All right, I'm gonna do a quick video here on a 700R4 or 4L60 on the lockup solenoid and how that works. So the simplest way to wire it would be you have a main power coming in that you're gonna run through like a brake switch and then have a on off switch to arm the system. So your main power going from your on off switch through your brake switch comes in here and what you do is that wire is going to run up follow up and go to your lockup solenoid then the other side of your lockup solenoid is going to be a ground wire it's going to come down comes back down and it goes over to the fourth gear basically it's a pressure switch so that's the ground side of the solenoid it goes to this pressure switch when this pressure switch sees pressure from fourth gear it's internally grounds, so it just grounds to the valve body. So that in itself, right there, makes that lockup solenoid work as soon as you're in fourth gear. So as simple as that is one power wire off your brake switch coming up, the other side of it goes to the fourth gear pressure switch that goes to ground with pressure. There is several types of these switches, so you do want to ohm it out, and you can actually give it pressure with like a air compressor make sure you have the type that when it sees pressure on fourth gear here that it actually goes to ground boom done that makes it work now if you wanted to get more sophisticated with it you could wire a relay into this and use a window switch you can get a window switch for like sixty dollars from summit or jigs or any of those and your window switch if you have like an msd box you steal a tack signal from that and wire that into your MSD, which goes to this window switch. And then just wire the window switch into a relay that also ties into this. So then you could adjust at what RPM in fourth gear this locks up. So you'd still have your brake switch, you'd still have your fourth gear, but then now you're just adding the basically the parameter of RPM, which you could just buy a window switch and wire it in that way with a relay but the simple way that 90 percent of people do it is this way just a main power wire coming in going to the lockup solenoid that runs through your brake switch and i like to run an on off switch that way you can turn lockup on when you want out on the highway shut it off when you're cruising around town and then the other side of it goes to the fourth gear pressure switch that grounds it you're done so couple different ideas there and how this works and different ways to set it up. Hopefully this helps some people and uh, we're just wrapping up this uh, build tonight. So I figured I'd do a quick video and show you guys how that works and the simplest way to do it, but also another option with the window switch. All right, that'll be it. Thanks.